Oh my god! Welcome to episode 23 of Activated Adventures. Where the goes is on the go. We are touring a workhouse. It used to be a prison, but it is now an art center in Lorton, Virginia. That's right. It was started as a prison about 100 years ago. And this used to be the baseball field that the inmates played on. You can see three watchtowers there. Somehow, I doubt that any of them ever stole home. The maximum and medium minimum security facilities here. And it changed over time. But when they first built it, you know, the prisoners themselves made it out of wood. The idea was reform. All right, well, this is the Workhouse Prison Museum. This right. half of the museum is about the suffragists who are mm -hmm. incarcerated here and the larger women's movement. So instead of prisoners in here now, we have artists creating and selling their wares and making really cool things. This is the glass supply store. We are in the wing. Oh, we've done glass beading before. This looks all familiar. This is stuff that you can um, you take these these long sticks and then you heat them up over a really hot fire. Maybe add in some little fritz and make some really cool things. We've done glass beads before. Do you have a glass bead that we'll be able to show that oh, we made? I might have. We have not made plates before, but we have made some glass bees with our friend Jen in California. Actually, I think I do. Wait, you have your bead with you? I do, I have one of them. All right, so that's an example of something that we've made. I'm gonna take a little tour and see what goes on. Somebody working right now. So there is a class going on right now. There. It's not often that you have a chance to go see so many artists at work. Uh, on a, some days you can see quite a few of them here working and uh, in, in, in different media from clay to paint to cloth to glass to metal, all kinds the of media. Theater arts. Yes. And you can actually peek over their shoulder and, and ask them questions. They're happy to talk Behind to Behind these doors is the clay that they use. It's not wet yet, so you have to it's have like, a respirator. It's like clay, maybe plaster, or things that have to be mixed with water. Right. Porcelain clay in this one. And there are workshops and classes that you can participate in, even if you aren't a resident artist at the facility. And shows that you can go to. Hmm. Okay, paintings. Wow. Cool. We just met the artist that made all this really, really cool stuff from, from Berlin and got a chance to talk to him and he told us all about his work. Actually in Berlin. He would sneak into old abandoned buildings and take photographs and then he painted the photographs. Don't tell anyone. Don't tell anyone. <laughs> we had to move some stones and crawl down <laughs> into the basement. And the building was actually torn down shortly after I took it. Not just painted, he used to mix medium. It's not it, oil, it's like it, acrylic with torn paper and... It's an, uh, a medium that he invented. That he invented. He gives a lot of depth to it, has all these big cracks it in it. Makes it really pop out. Yeah. Really cool. Actually, if you look at these two images here, it's the same stairway from different angles. Is it real? Oh, up and down. So this is looking, this is looking down. If you stand here and look up, you get that. Gotcha. Wow, and no rails, no handles. That's the thing to think about because yes. I'm standing there. I'm terrified. I'm like, oh my God, because it's not just down here. It's several more floors down. It's just like, oh my please, God. Please, oh. please stay under my feet. Please stay under my I'm feet. I usually have playing heights, but it's just like, <sighs> Very is cool. portrait your favorite? What do you prefer? I do like to do portraits and um, scenery with people in it. But I do like to, you know, when, when it's beautiful weather, I do love to uh, paint, um, you know, nature too as well. Mm -hmm. And now I pull the wrong side of the door. <laughs> These adventures only had open doors. <laughs> Failing miserably at it. Fiber arts. This is mine. Working with cloth. Wonderful work by all of the artists. So impressive, so inspiring to see them at work and to see where their creativity leads them. Look like photographs. They look, oh my goodness, so real. One of them is of her three sons who are all Marines. And, and that one's called The Brothers. The Brothers. And she hasn't been painting that long from what I gather. Only a few years. A lot of blue going on. This is the performing arts wing. Where you put the paintings up and they do something. Like that. 
You want to see some art? We have visited the Workhouse Art Center and we have seen a lot of artists at work. Very interesting to see what they're up to and their supplies that they use, the materials, and, and their creation process and to talk to them. And they were also getting ready to have some kind of dance rehearsal in there. There were. Um, yes, we did not get a chance to film everything that we saw here, but if you have a chance, if you are just south of D.C. in Lorton, Virginia, make sure you stop by and visit the workhouse for a little inspiration and a chance to talk to some artists. And some history. And, of course, if you're interested in buying art, this would be a good place to check that out, too. Absolutely. Used to be a prison, and now it's an art studio for many, many artists. It has been transformed, which is what art is supposed to do.